Have you ever had a fresh baked bun with chopped brisket inside? I haven't until today. Check it out. We're going to start by making the bun dough. This is a Joshua Wiseman bun recipe. Best one I've ever used so far. We're going to start by mixing the dry ingredients together and get that mix master going and add the yeast mixture with milk, some eggs, add that tangjong, add the melted butter, and let it go just a little bit longer, a few minutes until that dough is nice and ready to roll. Once the dough is all mixed, we're going to add it to a grease bowl, cover it, let it rise for about an hour and a half. While that dough is rising, we're going to chop up some day-old brisket, and then just mix it together with some favorite barbecue sauce. Now let's make those buns. Take out that dough, punch it down, flour your counter, and then we're going to take that dough and I'm going to cut it up into about 10 to 12 equal sized pieces. From there, you just want to roll up all those pieces into nice round balls and place them on the counter. At that point, you want to take each one of the 10 to 12 balls and flatten them out into what looks like a nice little piece of dough, form it into a cup, and add your brisket, about a teaspoon worth. And then fold the bottom all together, and then roll that bun on the counter back and forth until it seals the bottom nice and tight. Then we'll take those meat stuffed buns, place them on some parchment paper, and let them rise for about 30 minutes. Preheat your oven to 350 degrees, and then give those buns an egg wash and lay down some sesame seeds on top. Then we're simply going to bake those buns for about 13 to 15 minutes, and then let them cool on a wire rack. And now check these out. They're ready to eat. Soft, chewy, tasty, brisket-filled meat buns. So good.